So I want to know how much of this $2,000 that you snookered out of your babysitter did you pay back? Uh, in October of 2016, my ex-husband moved out and my daughter was already cheerleading since May of that year and it just was the start of her cheerleading competition. Listen, don't, hey, I didn't ask you for a whole gashry about your daughter's she cheerleading camp. I don't care about it. She didn't it. actually say Hey! <clears throat> don't speak to me. Yes, ma'am. I asked you how much of the $2,000 did you pay back? I don't need a whole story about your husband left you and your daughter wanted to go to cheerleading camp. I asked you how much of the $2,000 did you pay back? I don't remember. Well, exactly. let's try so to think of, let's try to think about it. Maybe we'll go back. What was the name of the cheerleading camp? Um, oh, it's not an answer. An answer is an answer. What was the name of the cheerleading camp? Um, ACX. Was it for a whole summer? It was for nine months altogether. So it was a nine-month program? Yes. Are they still in existence? I don't think so anymore. I tried contacting them, and I could not. And did they advertise on the Internet? I believe they did. Good. And how much was the nine-month program? Look it's at me. How much was the nine-month program? It's around $300 a month. So that would be $2,700 if it's a nine-month program, right? Yes, it's actually more. There's other fees, too, on top of the monthly like fee. Like what? There's uh, traveling costs and uniform costs and uh, well, but, tumbling lessons. But she, according to you, gave you $2,000. Is that right? Yes. How did you get together the rest? Well, in the spring, Michelle paid for Taylor's uniform and her practice clothes, too. So her and my daughter are really close, and she wanted her to be able to keep cheering. Don't tell me what she wanted. That calls for the operation of her head. Okay. Now tell me how much you paid her back. I paid back a Just payment. Just think. Let it all come together before so you open ago. your mouth. Uh, how much did you pay her back? I think back? like $200. And the phone. And a cell phone. I gave her a cell phone, too. I don't care about a cell phone. Okay. You paid her back $200. How do you yes, support yourself? I work. For whom? I'm a bartender. Do you have custody of your daughter? I do. Good. Now, you know that she has no proof. So you're telling me that she paid $2,700 because that's what the camp was, right? Yes, ma'am. And of that, you paid her back, you say. I'm not asking her anything because she has no proof. 200. Yes, ma'am. And a phone. What is he saying? And a phone. And the phone was worth 400. Out. Out, out. Out. Out where? Out. That way. Out the ring? That way, where it says exit. Wow. Judging for the plaintiff, the amount of $2,500. We're finished. Bodies are excused. You may step out. I feel like she was fair in the fact that, you know, I'm getting something back for what I give. I give a lot. I think Judge Judy was fair. And Kristen was my best friend, and I really hope that we can rekindle the friendship. We try not to talk about it that much because of our... We, we didn't want it to affect our friendship, so... But I don't know where it's going to go from here. Between our friendships, some, but I'm hoping we can move past it now. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you.